You go to Cambodia for what? Study Cambodian. What? It's easy to learn Cambodian from anywhere. You just go to the website kummerlessons.com and choose a tutor. That's it. Really? What's that easy? Yes, of course. I'm learning Cambodian with them too. Can I cancel the flight? Hello guys, welcome back to Learn Cambodian with my channel and I'm Dara from the Khmer lesson. But uh, I hope everyone is good and today I have a new lesson for you. But, and in this lesson, everyone will learn the name or I can say 20 names of Khmer dessert but in, in Cambodia. So for foreigners who are living in Cambodia and would like to buy Khmer dessert and don't know how to uh, say the name of the, that, that dessert, okay, just watch this video and after that you will know how to say the name of that dessert. But, and also for uh, Khmer Americans who live in the uh, United States and would like to know the name of Khmer dessert, okay, please watch this video. Because like uh, for elder people, yes, I think they know already about the name of Khmer dessert. But for, uh, for young generation, like their kids, yes, I think mostly they don't know the names of Khmer dessert. So if you would like to know the name of Khmer dessert, just watch this video, okay? And I think it's very useful for you. Okay, ta. so uh, right now, if you are ready, let's go to the lesson. Okay, right now we can start by Khmer Desserts. By Khmer Desert. So before we learn the name of Khmer Desert, just learn the word desert first. But the word desert in Khmer, you say Bong Aim. Bong Aim. Okay, ba Bong Aim. It's similar to the word sweet. You know, sweet, sweet in Khmer, we say Pa Aim. Na? Pa Aim. Bong, bong aim, because like dessert always sweet, right? But dessert always sweet. So the word dessert bong aim, the word sweet aim, okay? Aim. And if you would like to say khmer dessert, ba khmer dessert in khmer you say bong aim khmer, ba we say uh, bong aim first and then khmer, bong aim khmer, ba. Ta, now let's start uh, to see the first uh, khmer dessert, ba. First one is Sunday kill. Ba like you see in the picture we say Sunday kill. Ba uh, Sunday by itself it means bin ba bin and kill is blue. Ba so uh, the meaning it means blue bin ba Sunday kill. But the, the color is a bit green. Nah? But uh, we don't say by tong because the word green in Khmer you say by tong, right? But this one we say blue ba. So uh, uh, this dessert we call Sunday Q ba Sunday Q And next one is Sunday Kro Hom ba Sunday Kro Hom it is same uh, uh, it is the same as number 1 but just change from a uh, uh, blue to red ba and we use bin again Sunday Kro Hom ba Kro Hom is red na ba Sunday Kro Hom And number 3 is Bo Bo Chadau ba Bo bo chadau. Okay. And it bo bo by itself, it means porridge. So you see, it looks like a porridge, but it's a bit thick. Uh, and then you just add the name after the word porridge. And then you say bo bo chadau. Ba bo bo chadau. Okay. And number four, ba bang chanu. Bang chanu. Ba in spoken, we always say like that. Bang chanu. Uh, I cannot separate the word because just the name ba. so uh, uh, cannot separate the word ba. next one Cha Hui Khmer ba. Cha Hui Khmer like you see in the picture ba. the color is black so Khmer is black and Cha Hui you know Cha Hui is jelly ba. so this dessert it means like black jelly ba. Cha Hui Khmer Cha Hui Khmer uh, and number six, Pro Krong. 
บาปลอกรองอันนี้ it's similar to jelly but uh, the color is green บา is green นะ uh, and you call ปลอกรอง but in spoken uh, in spoken my people like to say ปลอกองปลอกอง so when you go to buy dessert and you would like to order this one you just say ปลอกองนะปลอกอง we never say ปลอกรอง very clear like this never just say ปลอกองปลอกองบาบาร์ number seven number seven we call ตาสวนบาร์ actually in write in in written we we write ตาสวนตาสวน but in spoken my people like to say ตาสวนนะตาสวนบาร์เอ่ออันนี้ I like this one as well บาร์ตาสวน and you see in the picture like this cake we call จากไข่นะจากไข่ but I don't know how to call in English but in my when you see I uh, would like to buy this one and you would like to say this we call จากไข่บาร์นมจากไข่บาร์นมจากไข่ and uh, this one is not really expensive not, not expensive in my you can uh, buy with like 500 real or 1000 real but just like a pair of จากไข่บาร์ so and it's not not uh, not expensive but So when we eat tau suan, but always uh, eat with cha khoai. Nah, mostly eat with cha khoai. And number eight, but number eight easy. This is Milan, but Milan. So uh, at at like the place that they sell my dessert, they always have a uh, Milan all the time. But so uh, this one easy to just use the word uh, Milan. That in my you say tro sa sre. ตรอสักสระบาดิซิสเวิร์ดมิลันตรอสักสระนัมเบอร์นังบอบบอทนาวบอบบอทนาวบาดนาวบีอุสบอบบอแกนอิสพอริชแอนด์ทนาวยูโน่ทนาวอินมินพามพามฟรุตบาดลายูซีอินเดอะพิเชอร์เลยอะบิดไวอันนี้พามฟรุตนะแดนอินขมายบีเซทนาวอ๋อแพลทนาวบาดพามฟรุต So when they uh, make uh, like uh, uh, make dessert with palm fruit, we call b o b o t n o u t b o b o t n o u t Ba. Number ten, ba similar, just use corn instead of a uh, palm fruit. And corn, you know, we say p o t Ba p o t like you see in the small bowl. Ba we call p o t n And then this dessert we call b o b o p o t Ba b o b o p o t Corn porridge. Ba corn porridge. b o b o p o t บาร์ number eleven is lard sweat บาร์ lard sweat a lard lard by itself it mean like uh, you see in the picture with the green uh, color or pink color บาร์ that one we call lard and sweat บาร์ sweat the meaning it means like tough tough when you think about meat okay tough it mean it's a bit hard to chew and this lard as well บาร์ Like it's a bit hard to chew, but it's easy to swallow. Nah, but no problem. But so and easy, easy to eat. But and the name, but let's what, let's what. Okay. And number twelve, but number twelve, everyone know already. This is sticky rice, but sticky rice. And uh, we always have two type of this dessert. Uh, the first one you can order with uh, durian, but durian. And another one, uh, we 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 have sangsha that we always call sangsha. So how to to order this dessert? They always say buy them now to rain, but buy them now to rain. It means like sticky rice with durian. Maybe like you see in the picture, the taste is durian. And another one, you can order uh, buy them now sangsha. Nah, buy them now sangsha. So depends on on what you want, but. So in this picture, I just say buy them now, nah, buy them now, and the meaning is sticky rice, ba, buy them now, sticky rice. And number thirteen, ba, number thirteen, bo bo trau, ba, bo bo trau. Ani it is same as bo bo put, bo bo trau, bo bo chadu, but we use trau, and trau is taro, ba, trau. Is taro, so I need taro porridge. Bo bo trau, ba bo bo trau. Number fourteen, lock chat, ba lock chat. 
Okay, so in the bowl, like you you see a lot of things in the bowl, but the log chart is the white one that you see in the bowl, but uh, that one we call log, log chart. This is a type of fruit, na, but, and uh, mostly my people, when uh, they eat log chart, they always mix with jelly or something else, okay, depends on what they want. But, and then the one that you see in the bowl with the white one like this, we call log chart, but, log chart, but. And number 15, but number 15, but you see the picture is banana and then they use something. And uh, this one we call Jake But Jake But Jake is banana. And you know Kti. Kti is like, it means like coconut milk. But we call Kti or Kti Dong. But so uh, this dessert we call Jake Kti. But Jake Kti. And next one, number 16. But number 16, like you see in the picture, but maybe like uh, some students, they don't know what, what is it. But so this uh, this dessert we call tropai. But for me, I like this so much. Uh, it's yeah, it's delicious. Tropai. But in spoken, we like to say tapai. Tapai. So when you go to buy my dessert and you would like to buy this one, you just say tapai. But tapai. You don't need to say tropai like this. But just follow my, you say, tapai, tapai, okay, ba, tapai, ba. Number 17, ba, number 17, like you see in the picture, it is pumpkin, and they use like, you have with the white one. Uh, previous, previous uh, dessert, I, I told you already about sticky rice, but they have sun share. So the white one like, uh, with that pumpkin but that one we call songsha not songsha like uh, in by the name of the, this this dessert we say songsha lepe songsha lepe but lepe is pumpkin but like you see in the picture pumpkin is lepe and this one is uh, songsha nah? songsha that with sticky rice you say by the map songsha is this word but by the map songsha but, okay, so for number 17, you say Sang Sha La Pau Sang Sha La Pau eh? And number 18 But number 18, and it, it's similar to jelly And the color is green And it's a bit tough as well And we call Bánh Đục Bánh Đục Yeah, this one a bit sweet eh? Bánh Đục but. Number 19, ba ani is jelly. Ba jelly, that we say cha hui. Ba cha hui. And uh, mostly we like to say cha hui dong. It means coconut jelly. Ba coconut jelly. So you say cha hui or cha hui dong. Ba. And the last one is chap chai. Ba chap chai. And I can say like you cannot find easily at uh, my like like the shop that sell my dessert because only like just some place some place is only that they sell chap chai but you know the meaning chap chai chap chai the general meaning it means like besides this dessert when someone say chap chai it means like they mix a lot of things together but so it we call chap chai nah? chap chai uh, you can use uh, the word chap chai with soup as well but so when you put a lot of things together you make a one type of soup so that soup we call sam lo chap chai it means like you put a lot of uh, food together to make okay another food but we call chap chai so you see in in this bowl that there are a lot of things but i don't know how to yeah i don't know what 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 else in this bowl and then you see yeah a lot of things so uh, the, the name of this dessert bar we call chap chai chap chai eh? bar. Bar, that's all for this video and i hope everyone enjoyed this and thanks so much for watching and if you are uh, uh, not clear or have any question would like to ask me about this just let me know in the comment section and i will try to answer your question bar. Uh, again, thanks so much for watching and see you in the next video.